Hello my friends, today we will talk about this beautiful kit of yarns, it's Italian viscose in 4 colors. By using such fantastic colors we can make transition of colors that you can see right now, uh, this blouse Sonia. Also for this incredibly beautiful lace I used such colors and you can see how interesting can be result. And you can use only 2 or 3 colors for your motifs like we have at the left side. For uh, I use it very light colors, and for these beautiful leaves, I use these more dark colors. So it's really uh, interesting and uh, fantastic that we can use such beautiful shades of turquoise color and green color and create something special. And today I want to show you how to change colors. Yes, attach new thread and create this amazing, just magical transition of colors. We will start from this very light color and all the time I am working with three threads I will use crochet hook in size 1.75 mm and I will show you sample of this lace that I use for blouse Sonia but I will make very short sample so I will change colors for each row but it's not matter because in the end you will see this magical result and I am sure this will be very interesting for you so let's start okay so we have here four very beautiful colors uh, we have turquoise very light, turquoise green, more intensive and a really beautiful and dark thread like this. And this all colors will look just amazing together. Also we have such sample of lace. You can see closer how it looks. Very beautiful, starting from very light color, go to the green turquoise and very dark one. And now we can start. I will take three very light colors, such small steel hook, and I will make first row and show you the result. And uh, work with such uh, thread is really pleasant, because thread is very soft, uh, shiny, silky, and I joined three threads together and you can see how easy I can work with this yarn and I can create even such yes small chain and it's not a problem. If you're afraid to work with such threads, please don't worry because I am sure you will work with it also like me, yes, very easily and fast. So now I need to prepare chain, just this, this will be base for my lace of sample of lace and next I will create first row. So now you can see first row is ready. This thread is very silky, soft and beautiful. And now I will show you how to join new color. Like you know we are working with three threads like this and we will join second color, this one. So we need to cut one of these threads, a leaf tail can be long because next when we will finish to make the lace we will hide this tail by using needle with big eye. So I will cut one of threads and I will take new color. So we have new thread here. I will place it, yes, I will join it together with these three threads, but I will leave tail at the right side. So I will need to place it like this tail here, four threads together right now. Just by fing fingers you need to hold all these threads and after take like this crochet hook and make yarn over. Next, these four threads draw through this working loop one time and again yarn over and draw second time. That's all, we join it new thread. Just in this moment I will draw this tail that I cut before, this light one, till I see it at the right side. Now I see it at the right side and Next, move back, just make smaller this working loop and uh, we have now only three threads, two light threads and one this new thread. And we have two tails, light tail and this new one. So now I can continue to work. I have uh, two chain loops, I will make more just to show you how it works. Now I can continue to work with new colors and I will make new row by using these three threads. After we will start new row and I will join second thread in this beautiful green turquoise thread. Now I finish it next row by using new colors. Yes, and now we can join second skein for new row. So I have here three threads. I will take again this light color from these colors we started. And now I will cut the yarn and join second skein in this beautiful green turquoise color. So I cut one of these light threads and now I have this yes, green turquoise yarn, new one. Just we need to join this thread 
two three threads like this and the leaf tail at the right side of this new tail around 25 20 centimeters now just by fingers you need to join these four threads together and make yarn over take all the threads to your, on your hook yes and draw these four threads through working loop I will show you now and draw these four threads through your working loop one one time next second time and now I will draw this all tails threads to the right side till I see this light tail here I see it so we have it here at the right now I can move back all these threads and make this working loop yes like we had before small one and now we join a new thread we can continue to work and make new loops like this very easily now we have two green uh, turquoise threads and one just a light turquoise and I will make one more row by using this three threads after we will start new row by using this third skein and in this case we will have three uh, threads in the same color and uh, now you can see next row is ready looks really fantastic and I am ready to join new thread new yes, skein and in this moment uh, when we will join this thread we will work with three the same threads in the same color and we will make next row in this beautiful green turquoise color so I already cut this last light turquoise thread and uh, I took this new one thread and I am ready to join this all threads together so uh, we need to just uh, by fingers hold four threads together I will show you now closer you need to take four threads together yes and leave tail of this new thread at the right side around 20 centimeters now just you need to take four threads around your hook and draw these four threads through working loop one time after second time and now draw all these threads to the right side till you see this yes tail this light turquoise tail that we have the last one i see it so now i can move back and make this working loop smaller after i can work with only three threads in green turquoise color and make new row so now we can see this light tail will stay here at the bottom and also green new yes tail will stay here and we will work with three threads like this after this step by step i will join new colors each time for one new row i will take new skein and in this way i will make this beautiful and interesting transition of colors so i will show you just step by step few rows and you will see how I will add new colors and how uh, this lace will be bigger. Okay, so I already finished two rows. Now I joined this one thread, already one thread in this color. And now I can take second one and join it. And with this beautiful combination of colors, I will make next row. So I cut one of these green turquoise threads. I will take a new thread in more intensive color. I will join together four threads, leaf tail of this new yarn at the right side and now four threads I will take around my hook, just make yarn over, take four threads, draw them through working loop, once again yarn over and draw through working loop. Now I will draw this all threads to the right side, I see these tails that I cut out before and now move back just three threads. And I can continue to work, yes, with New, co new combination of colors and I will make new row and show you the result but also I will uh, finish to make next row by using this one skein and together with you we will join first sk uh, skein of this beautiful and really intensive beautiful color and I already finished two next rows and I really enjoyed the work with this all colors and result is amazing now we can start to work with the most yes intensive color this one is really gorgeous and i will join first skein so for this i already cut one of these threads previous threads and now i can join new color just i will join together four threads leave this uh, tail of new thread at the right side just I need to leave around 25 centimeters so I will do like this now it's too too long okay now it's okay so I join together four threads now yarn over and 
draw this all threads through working loop like this I will show you closer and again take all these four threads yarn over and draw threads through working loop that's all now we need to uh, draw this all threads to the right side I see this tail yes it's here now we can move back and work with three threads we join it new beautiful color and will be interesting to work next I will make next two rows this one with one uh, thread in the last color and second row I will join second skein and I will have two the most dark threads after we will start the last row by using the last third skein and this will be the last part of our sample of our lace and I'm sure you will enjoy to watch the result and now you can see I finish it next two rows looks like this beautiful lace and now I will join yes the last skein in dark color and I will make the last rows and finish this sample of lace I really enjoy to work with these all colors it's so interesting and looks fantastic so let's join new thread yes the last skein and start to make the last few rows I cut the last thread that I used yes in previous color and now we will take this one join together again four threads leave tail at the right side and now four threads together and draw through this working loop just yarn over take this all four threads together like this make yarn over and draw four threads through working loop one time and the same yarn over and draw through working loop second time now just draw all threads to the right side till you see this tail yes we have it and now move back three threads and everything is ready for work we have three threads we can continue to work and this will be the last combination of the most dark threads and this will be a really nice uh, yes nice nice few rows of this amazing lace I will work and next show you the result I am sure you will enjoy to see it I finish it to make uh, this beautiful lace it's so beautiful silky shiny tender I already hide all tails and I don't need it you can see uh, yes this beautiful result we have here four different colors and it's my favorite thread and it's so so beautiful and tender especially I love to use it for blouses tops uh, skirts and dresses and uh, during this small video you saw how I changed colors you can change colors yes in different way just you can make some parts longer some short parts and just you know now how to join these thin threads you know how to work with them and it's a really interesting process I hope you will enjoy to create your own design and uh, you will create some special projects for yourself for your family and friends you can create a different yes variants of lace by using these threads like I already showed you it's this one this lace it's also uh, was made by using such threads Italian viscose in the same colors just I took another pattern from magazine and I try to work with it and I really love it so you can see it now fabulous result very interesting and such laces we can use for our projects uh, I'm sure you will love to use these threads for your projects also if you want to use uh, these threads you can order this kit with a 25% discount and free shipping worldwide we have here 600 grams because one ball has 50 grams so in total uh, we have 600 grams and it's enough to create even a cocktail dress or you can create a blouse in big size or oversized blouse or skirt also will be enough with a transition of colors yes of course it's the most interesting process I think thank you so much for your attention and see you at the new video bye bye for now